everybody, and welcome to this series of 10-minute interviews with Daphne Bryan. I'm Sergio Piesch, and Daphne has just joined me today from the UK. Daphne is the author of the book Parkinson's and the B1 Therapy. The book has been published in March 2022 and has since been growing in popularity, selling over 3,000 copies in eight months. The book is now available already in five languages, English, French, Dutch, Spanish and Italian, with the German translation on the way. I want to mention that the profits from the sales of the book go entirely to a fund to support the conduct of a randomized, double-blind, placebo-controlled trial on the use of B1 therapy in Parkinson's disease. Since April 2022, Daphne also runs a Facebook group on Parkinson's B1 therapy, which now counts more than 2,200 members from 84 different nationalities around the world. She shares evidence-based and anecdotal information about the B1 therapy. Daphne was diagnosed with Parkinson's in 2010 at the age of 61, 13 years ago. Seven years later, after reading an article about Dr. Costantini, she first tried vitamin B1 in 2017. Like everybody with Parkinson's, her life was shattered by the diagnosis of a disease which by definition progresses inexorably and for which to date there are available medicines only to control symptoms. Dr. Costantini's research and protocol offer that hope that all persons with Parkinson's are dreaming of, slowing down, if not halting, the progress of the disease. Now, five years later, and 12 years since the diagnosis, Daphne shows hardly any progress of the disease, and her therapy has remained unchanged. This is totally unexplained to her GP and neurologist, as even with the current therapy, the disease would be bound to worsen every year. Daphne wanted to share her experience with as many people as possible, and she has been generously dedicating all her time to this mission, as much as Dr. Costantini did with his patients. Daphne has been a teacher all her life, and her communication skills are evident when she explains the protocol so clearly in her book, making it easy to understand a complex subject, from the science behind the protocol to the protocol itself. The content of this interview is provided for information and education purposes only. You should consult your physician for advice on treatment, including supplements. Supplements may interact with other medicines and other health conditions. So please check with your doctor first. Mm -hmm.